Welcome to my last chance qualifiers predictions for the international 11 in Singapore. As you can see right here, as of today, you can make predictions for the winners, two winners of the last chance qualifiers. It's going to be a bracket, in which case the uh, winner of the upper bracket final and the lower bracket final uh, will win. There will be no grand final because it's just to qualify. As you can see here, these are the teams participating. We got Navi, Liquid, Vici Gaming, Secret, Infamous, Tempest, T1, Extreme Gaming, Wildcard Gaming, Polaris, VP, or Outsiders, which are totally not VP, trust me, dude. And Nouns. I'm pretty happy with how I did predicting the uh, regional qualifiers. I think my, my track record is pretty good. But... Uh, Aside from that, I think this is much harder, in my opinion. Because at the end of the day, we haven't seen all these teams uh, compete internationally yet. Like, uh, for example, I'd say Nouns and Wildcards, like the NA teams have been very isolated. Like, the only teams those teams play, other than the teams from NA, really, are maybe South American teams in like a BTS Pro Series. Uh, and the same kind of goes for most of these South American teams. I don't think I've seen uh, Tempest or uh, Infamous play internationally yet. And this is going to be an international competition. Which is also why I would tend to favor those teams who have international experience. That would be uh, Vici, Secret, VP. Or, well, it just said Outsiders earlier. V really interesting. T1, of course, kind of. This year, not so much, especially with the roster change and everything, but still. Yeah, and there's only two slots, which, which makes this really hard. Um, I'd say VP or Outsiders is kind of a front runner for sure. I mean, you have to consider they would have qualified for the international, you know. Wouldn't have been it uh, for like the weird, you know, rounding of points. You could argue they kind of should be there, so they might get there. But that, that's also what I said for the regional qualifiers, in which they got absolutely stunned from uh, Bed Boom, who came from the lower bracket and 3 0'd them in the grand finals. I was not ready for that. So, yeah, I don't know. Uh, when it, I think. It would be pretty easy to say, like, which of the teams are stronger coming out of uh, the regions. Like, which of the two is the stronger team. For uh, Eastern Europe, I'd say Outsiders or VP are for sure the, uh, the better team. And for Europe, I'd say, also say Secret is for sure better. And NA Nouns is for sure better. VT or Extreme, I, I, I'm I not all that sure. Uh, Polaris or T1, I'm also not all that sure. Probably Polaris, though. Uh, and for SA, I'm also not sure. But yeah. I kind of uh, want to believe in NA. But there's really not any reason for me to, except for, like, Nouns BDG... They've had close, they beat, they actually 2 0'd uh, Sonics in the regionals and then lost the grand finals 3 0. Uh, so Nouns, Nouns can definitely make some waves. Problem is, they're not really that experienced internationally. I think the most exper experienced player here is Gunner. And of course, uh, Mamu and Zeefrig are decently experienced, I guess. But they haven't like played internationally in a while. Um. Other strong contenders for me are Extreme and Secret as well. I think Secret, just like Entity, is probably like a top six team in the world right now, if I would have to guess. And you know, I don't think there's any any shame in losing to them. Doesn't mean you're bad at all. They just kind of, you know, didn't have the points because of the roster changes and everything. And you know, getting like getting 
into the season so late. Just like getting to Division 1 so late, but they are looking really good, so that could mean entering at C but then again I don't think Secret and Entity are on the same level. I don't expect any of the South American teams to come out of the last chance. I don't know about the SEA teams, man. See this this thing is really stacked. It's all these two slots. Maybe T1 come out. Uh yeah, maybe Polaris comes out. Yeah. But all things considered, I'm like I'm like thinking about either VP and nouns or VP and secret. Maybe VP and extreme. I'm not sure. I, I gotta look up uh how uh how the Chinese qualifier actually went. Who who lost in the grand finals out of these two teams? Let's see China. Extreme got three owed. Hoo hoo. Uh. So then it's probably not VG. Wait, let me see how uh, VP did in the bracket. Mm, or Outsiders did in the bracket. Oh, they never played Bed Boom. Huh, interesting. Hmm, I, I, look, I believe, I believe in Neff, I believe in NA, I believe in the boys, I believe in Seafreak, I believe in Moo, I believe in Gunner. I'm, I'm giving one slot to Nouns. I think they can do it. Call me crazy. And the other slot, oh. Hey, look, China, hey, China's the strongest region. You can't, can't argue with that. Maybe, wait, PYW, Paparazzi, Old Eleven. DY, all those players have LAN experience. So yeah. I think those I think those are my two teams. And I'm really excited to watch the last chance qualifier on the eighth. So yeah, that's all from me on the last chance qualifier. That's who I think is gonna win. Extreme and now.